Hi uh, YouTube. Here's the update y'all been waiting for on this Mother's Day. My grandma's running rose vine that she brought back from Lake City, Florida. Yep, we are gathering flowers. We're gathering flowers. And uh, I just wanted to show y'all that. So happy Mother's Day to all the mamas. Mamas, mamas, babies, mamas. I was mama, mama's, mama's, mama's. Look at that, pure beauty. My grandma gave me a piece of this when she was alive, this big, this big, and it's turned into that, 10 foot high. Awesomeness, stay tuned. Okay, now I wanted to come, my grandma was the type of person, she's told me all the time, give me my flowers while I'm alive, but we managed to uh, get her some flowers and a piece of my white striped Japanese bamboo or Chinese bamboo she liked it. In loving memory of Lady Nell Brown, December 1st, 1935 to March 30th, 2014. Married February 2nd, 1951. Although my grandpa is still alive, he don't want nobody to have to uh, worry about anything when he's dead. So he put also in loving memory of Rupert B. Brown, November 9th, 1930. And left the rest blank until it's done. And I set, I set these in concrete. My uncle was also buried here. And there's another stone made for him. I'm going to etch this out and put it in there. But we're not here about that. Here for Mother's Day. Um, are you filming for me, baby? Yeah. Happy Mother's Day to you too, darling. Thank you. My, my wife and son. Um, I got my grandpa's Bible here. I don't study the Bible, but... My grandma did, and I don't know exactly what psalm it was, but I was going to read her favorite one out of here. I know she's got marked in her Bible here. For he shall give his angels charge over thee to keep thee in all thy ways. I don't know if it was Psalms 90, Psalms 91. It was the one where um, she told me a long time ago, I didn't pay much attention, but I should have, where the war hero went over and he made all his soldiers uh, remember the uh, remember that and say it over and over every day and they were the only platoon that made it out alive unharmed and I think it was this one he that dwelleth Psalms 91 he that dwelleth in the secret place of the most high shall abide under the shadow of the almighty I will say of the Lord he is my refuge and my fortress my God in him I will trust Surely he shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowler and from the noisome pestilence. He shall cover thee with his feathers and under his wings shalt thou trust. His truth shall be thy shield and buckle. Thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night nor for the arrow that flieth by day nor for the pestilence that walketh in darkness nor for the destruction that waseth at noonday. A thousand shall fall at thy side, and ten thousand at thy right hand, but it shall not come nigh thee. Only with thine eyes shalt thou behold and see the reward of the wicked, because thou hast made the Lord, which is my refuge, even the Most High, thy habitation. There shall no evil befall thee, neither shall any plague come nigh thy dwelling. For he shall give his angels charge over thee to keep thee in all thy ways. They shall bear thee up in thy their hands, lest thou dash thy foot against a stone. Bear with me, people. Got the wind. Thou shalt tread upon the lion and adder. Adder, which is a snake. Thy young lion and thy dragon shalt thou trample under feet, because he hath set his love upon me, therefore I will therefore will I deliver him. I will set him on high, because he no, hath known my name. He shall call upon me, and I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble, I will deliver him I will deliver him and honor him. With long life I will satisfy him and shew him my salvation. I do believe that is the Psalms 
our favorite psalms of protection that the U.S. soldiers read, or the captain or colonel or whatever he was read to his uh, soldiers every day. But uh, I didn't mention she said to always give her flowers when she was alive. She'd really like these. If she was alive, she'd say she would say, uh, "Don't cut them pretty things for me, son." She didn't want anybody to think that. Uh, nothing to go to waste on her she was that that uh that giving of a person she didn't want to take nothing from anything anybody but she wanted to give to all i love her very much and i will miss her she also told me that uh love her while, while she's here and miss her while she's gone and when uh when she's gone she's just just an empty shell because her uh spirit's going on to better things to Join her father in heaven. Mikey, you got anything to say to her? To my lady. Happy Mother's Day. You gonna say it? Say Happy Mother's Day. Or Happy Mother's Day to your mama. <laughs> or your mama's mama. Mikey don't get do good around the ghost and stuff, and I guess there's a few around here. But uh, yep. That's that. Uh, kind of a shame that it's the only vase of flowers. I was expecting to see a lot of flowers here, but I guess when uh, when you die, some people forgot you, forget you, or something. I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't say that. It'll probably piss a lot of my family off. But I didn't forget you, my lady. That's for sure. No, now we'll be doing do something special for her today. I wanted to do something special for her today mm -hmm. because her Sarah <laughs> and me wanted to do something special for her today since it was Mother's Day and uh, I'll be doing an update of this when I put my uncle slab here because to honor him and uh, that's the spot so all my family will be buried here in this little place. So I literally built this cross, built the tomb buried my family and then uh, John Canfield another one of Rupert's sons had these stones made and he also had one made for my uncle and uh, I, uh, I'll be putting that up shortly and sharing it and tagging my cousin in it which is uh, my the son of my uncle that passed uh, Anyway, there were some pretty flowers. They won't last forever, but I'm sure she'll love them. As always, peace, love, and happiness, and all that good shit. Like, subscribe, tell your friends. Happy Mother's Day to all you mothers out there. Um, happy Mother's Day to all you grandmothers and great grandmothers if you're still living. And. Aunts, I'm taking care of your nieces and nephews. I know I've got one special one. Happy Mother's Day to Happy her. Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to everybody. You know, that's about all I got. Right? That's all we got. All right. Stay tuned for future other stuff. Church. No credit. Let's see what they wrote on her. No credit, no problem. Jesus paid your debt. The other side says uh, something about. Uh, Alright, peace.